Hey there. Uh, in today's video, I actually want to share a little secret with you at the beginning of this video. And that is actually that I'm not the most confident person uh, out there. Uh, I actually was quite shy growing up uh, when I was a child especially, but even in my 20s, I was quite shy and not the most confident. I'm a bit introvert. I'm not a person who is going to talk uh, to everybody on parties and start a conversation. So that being said, in today's video, I want to take my experience of becoming a YouTuber and creating videos and uh, even doing workshops, presenting uh, in front of people, uh, doing some public speaking. I want to share my experience and my tips for everybody out there who wants to become more confident and comfortable in front of the camera when you're filming yourself. Before going in depth in the video, uh, if you haven't been to my channel, my name is Brecht and I create videos around social media marketing, YouTube marketing, uh, entrepreneurship and camera gear. Um, most content is created for everybody out there who has an entrepreneurial mindset, who has a small business or, or wants to create content for small businesses or business purposes. If you want to find out more, please subscribe to my channel. It's down here somewhere. I always forget where it is exactly. But just go click on the subscribe button and maybe check out after, uh, after this video, maybe check out my channel and see my other videos. But let's go in depth on this week's subject and that is becoming more comfortable and confident in front of the camera. And I actually struggled a bit. I remember my first video that I uploaded to YouTube. Uh, I think I, the first part of my vlog, I was still vlogging then, a weekly vlog, but the first part was just me talking uh, to the camera. I filmed it on a Sunday evening. I was just talking to the camera. I think I recorded that uh, small bit of one minute, uh, maybe four or five times before I was happy with it. And that is also not that bad. Just uh, if you want to create videos, just place your camera there and start talking and saying what you want to say, just to become a bit more comfortable with looking into the lens and talk to the camera. Because that might be intimidating for a lot of people. It's just seeing this camera and not being able not be, being sure what to do uh, because you're not speaking to a person, you are alone in a room, you're talking to yourself and that might be a bit weird at once but it's just getting a bit comfortable looking at this camera and uh, start talking to your camera. Uh, I know for myself that my accent is yeah, I don't really like the accent in my English, but it's just the way that I'm speaking. I try to become a bit better in it, but it's just the way that I'm speaking and looking at footage of myself at the start when I was starting on YouTube, I really, I didn't really like looking at myself. I found all of the small things that were wrong, um, wrong ex expressions, that I raised my eyebrows too much, that my mouth wasn't completely straight, uh, that I wasn't looking into the camera that much and every time I was uh, making a mistake uh, in my language then I would be frustrated but it's just getting a bit uh, comfortable with hearing yourself and seeing yourself as well so make sure that you just start out, start talking, even if it's not a video that you are going to place online, just become, just to become a bit more comfortable with seeing and hearing yourself, because otherwise, if you're not comfortable with seeing yourself, you probably won't upload uh, the video. My second tip is to actually don't think of the camera as being just a camera. Uh, most videos on YouTube is explaining how to videos or ent entertaining videos. Well, the most popular YouTubers all say that they are creating videos for a specific person and that they are actually making videos just sitting in front of somebody and talking to somebody just like a friend. So maybe just imagine your best friend sitting there and you are explaining to him or her what this video is about and how they can become better at this or that. Just 
look at the camera as your best friend maybe even imagine somebody sitting in front of you and that you are talking to them instead of you talking to a camera okay so the next tip is to also know what you're saying and that is one of my biggest mistakes that I did at the start I really didn't prepare that much because all of the videos the things that I talk about I know what I'm talking about so I just try to wing it and not preparing at all and I ended up rambling a lot a lot a lot I know I still ramble sometimes and I repeat myself sometimes but try to prepare yourself a little bit know what you are saying in the video uh, one of the biggest mistakes maybe is preparing too much as well so just prepare enough for your videos okay so one thing that you can do uh, what I do is just I have this piece of paper uh, been underneath my camera and I just have bullet points noted there so that I know what I'm going to talk about if you script too much um, then you will uh, be uh, frustrated if you miss one sentence and you are going to have much more pauses because you want to say the exact thing that you have written down and just knowing what you are going to talk about and then using your expertise about this topic is much better than scripting everything out um, in my experience um, I have a, uh, I've, I've studied communication and I had classes into public speaking and uh, one, the first time that I had to do it, I scripted everything. I knew sentence per sentence what I was going to say. And that just made me so nervous because I wa didn't want to make a mistake in, in the sentences. Uh, I, whenever I lost what I was going to say, I would become more nervous. And I just tripped over words just because I wanted to say the things just exactly as I have written it down. So don't write out everything, just also wing it a little bit, but know what you are saying. Next step is just to talk a bit louder than you normally talk. Because if you talk louder, you're sitting alone in a room, if you talk a bit louder, you come across as a bit more confident and also talking louder is better for YouTube videos because if you are just talking a bit uh, soft then people might not hear what you want to say on the YouTube video. Just, just a little thing to take into consideration, talk a bit louder and you will become more confident uh, right away. The thing you didn't see right now, you just saw a jump cut, is that I actually took a sip of this glass of water that is standing here. And that is also something that is a tip for you. Because you are creating videos, you can also control what you are editing in and what you are deleting. So don't be afraid to make mistakes. Don't be afraid to say um or to have a little pauses in it or maybe if you feel that your throat is dry then just take a sip of water. You can all edit it out and um, just create sentences that make sense. And sometimes I, when I'm recording I just keep recording, I make a mistake, I do it all over again and then I just cut the blooper right out of it. So don't be afraid to make mistakes while you're talking. Don't be afraid to just take small pauses. Sometimes I'm just talking and talking and then I make a mistake and then I feel that uh, my breath is so high in my lungs that I feel that I'm getting out of breath and I just pause. I sit here and I just <sighs> relax a little bit and then I start talking again and then I cut out that part so nobody knows what is actually going on just like I just took a sip of my glass and you didn't even see it but I did it and then uh, next tip is don't focus too much on what you're doing um, and that is something that you have to get used to at the moment I'm really thinking because I'm giving this tip I'm really thinking about what I'm doing with my facial expression I'm thinking about how I'm do what I'm doing with my hands but if you focus on that too much 
then it comes across as very unnatural and you also are going to become a bit more stiff in your face just try to um, be how you want to be don't try to focus too much on how your hands are moving um, mostly the movements of your hands are quite natural because it's the movements that you always are doing just be sure that the things that you do with your hands are not distracting the focus off of your face or off of the subject of this video just make sure that your hand gestures or your facial expressions aren't really uh, distracting people and in other cases just try to be as natural as possible don't try to overthink what you're doing with your hands because if you're overthinking then it might get somewhat distracting because you are focusing more on how you are saying it and what you're doing with your hands and what you're doing with your face and you are not really telling what you want to tell and that is also my last tip just be yourself I know that my accent isn't the best I know I sometimes ramble on and ramble on I know that um, I have flaws in the video making that I do but just try to embrace them and don't try to hide who you are you are you just be you and try to be your uh, self that is friendly uh, be a bit more open open up to people just be yourself and don't try to be fake to become popular because if you are fake you're not able to proceed you're not able to uh, proceed with what you're doing so let's sum up all of the tips i have them as bullet points here so start talking start talking to your camera like it's a person imagine your best friend in front of your camera prepare but don't prepare too much Talk a bit louder, take pauses when you need them, uh, don't focus too much on what you're doing and just do you, be yourself and things will get better and you will become comfortable and confident in front of the camera. It might take some time but just take that time to become more comfortable. And that's it for this video. If you like this video please like it and also subscribe to my channel. And if you want to see more videos, the next one is already here and I will see you in that video. Bye.